Hi guys. Today I'm standing with the big boy here, Uluan. Unjan. No, good, good, good. Uh, you know, today I'm inspired to share uh, this piece of work with Uluan because he has started a great journey, a journey which is following uh, to his father's footsteps on how I made my first million. So, tell me about this journey of yours. Um, we start with Kadile in Venya Transport. So you started with your Venya Transport? Yeah. Is it a logistic business? So you'll be transporting things? Yeah. Okay. So what do you do? So we transport in a band in Pasaya, about for now to be tatty. So you go everywhere. Or around Okune, because that's where you are based. Guys, let me tell you something. Ulu and I started this transport business. How are you going to market and sell your business? Because you have been reading this book and then you got inspired. Now you can start from a small business. Guys, let me tell you something. When I say to, to people, I love and I, uh, you know, make sure that I encourage people to start their small businesses. I mean business. I mean a serious business. The van behind me belongs to Luandle. This is Luandle's van. So he's using this van. So we're going to be doing e-branding. He's using this van. He has spoken with different hardwares around for shifting. So whenever someone comes and buy stuff, those different hardwares, they will call him and say, hey Luandle, come and help us with the transport. And guess what? As much as he's not making too much money, but he's making good money, which is going to make him one day to make his own million rent. Eh? Are you inspired? So do you see yourself uh, making a million rent? I think so myself. Are you, do you know what are, are the principles of making a million rent? Because that's what is important. What are the principles? bank every cent you get everything. To bank every cent you get the cent that you are making every day. That is the key principle. I always say the reason why informal trading doesn't seem to have much value is not because it doesn't have value. It's because people who are operating within informal trading they don't realize the power, the potential of making money to make the very same money work for them. You know, it's a simple, basic principle. I appreciate this principle wherever I go. Today, people, they will think that because I am a business person, I am making so much money, uh, it's because it's where I started. No, I did not start from there. What Luanle is doing, Luanle will go to each and every hardware, he might load one or two loads per day. That is okay. Because out of those two loads, he will do what? Bank. I am teaching you this principle. You know, if you fail on this one, even if you are managing how much big business it is, you will fail. So as an informal trader, this guy has registered Mvela, Omvenya, Transport and logistics. And logistics. Okay, Luan. Let us do this. So, you know what I always say. You need to save this your car. You need to put fuel. Eh? You, you are not going to come and ask from me diesel money or whatsoever. Okay? Whatever that you are banking is the man that you are not going to need the following day. Do you know that? Eh? So if you have made 500 rands, you are going to bank 300 rands and you keep the 200 so that you carry on with the business on the following day. Eh? Because there is no need for you at the level you are to bank the whole 500 and then tomorrow you go to the bank and withdraw the 200. Eh? So the, the, the basic, you see, this is a very simplest way of making a million rand. Do you, do you see yourself making a million rand? Yes, I see myself making a million rand. 
you see yourself. Can you feel it? Can you feel in your body making a million rand, Lord? Yes, sir. So, so the first step is the courage that you have. You know, you know this young man is not saying, hey, because my father has done so well, I'm going to shadow myself under his wings. No! He's saying, Baba, help me to stand, to be independent, to do things on my own. And I like that. That is why I'm supporting him. He has got this van. Eh? He has got this van. He goes around. Luanza goes around. He... You do what? You're picking up stuff from different hardwares, which is a, be it's a beautiful thing, Luanda. Let me tell you, never feel ashamed of yourself. It's where all of us, we have started. And you must work because money does not come cheap, my boy. It's a very difficult thing. You must work for it. You must work for it. You must work for your money, you know. You must work for your money. And then you must bank every day. You see, we can't, we can't see your van. I want to see your van. I want to see this part. You know, I want to make sure that I see the van, you know, so that when the people, they see Luanle. But I'm so excited, guys, about the courage Uluanle that has got. So, you make between uh, 500 to 1,000 a day, eh? Yeah, you can say that. I can say, no, I want to hear it from you. You make between 500 to 1,000, eh? Roughly. Yes, yes. Okay. So, what then you do? You must make sure that every day you make some money. Eh? <clears throat> so, because you have, you have your own conduct. Eh? Luanda has also created a job opportunity for someone. It's exciting. Not only for himself, he has created a job opportunity for someone. So, someone is employed now by Luanda. So, it means this thing is a chain reaction. Luanda has got a van. He's helping his customers. He has negotiated a good rate with the hardware. He has also employed a conductor. A conductor who earns a living out of this business. Oh, wow, this is exciting. I'm excited already. You know, it feels good. You know, it feels good when you can see the fruits and the teachings, you know, of, of your own journey. Luandre, if you read this book, and you don't make an effort to achieve something out of it. Let me tell you, it, it will be meaningless. You must go and get this book from CNA. You must get this book from uh, Amazon. Yes. Oh, you know that. Oh, oh, smash well. You get this book. But what I like about what you are doing, but guess what, Luanke? You do not know what is coming. If you work every day, I also want to see the banking slips every day, for <laughs> each and every day. Yes, I'm your mentor. Eh? You are fortunate that you have me as your mentor. So as a mentor, even if you make only 200 rand loans, but 50 rands must go to the bank. 150, you put fuel here. You know, and oil. And you must wash your car. It looks presentable because that is part of what makes the business going. I can see that you were driving in a muddy road because you were transporting some stuff. Eh? But it's okay because this is, is like your spade. Eh? This is like your spade. You use it. It's your tool. It's your working tool. So guys, let me tell you, this young man is learning very well. So I have given him a tool. It's his van. But what I did not do was to give him courage. The courage that he has got comes from within. You know, it comes from within. It excites me. You know, the courage. All of us, we need courage. We need to start from somewhere. A journey of thousand miles starts with one step. And I know that Luanda, you are going to be successful. No matter what, my boy, you are going to make it because you are courageous. Tell me, is it easy to load this stuff and go and offload? No, it's not easy. Is it difficult? Are there some times where you feel like giving up? Um, speak in the 
food, yeah. Sometimes I feel, feel like giving up. Sometimes you feel like giving up. But what gives you, what, what, you know what brings you up? What gives you courage? What gives you strength to go on? Yeah. I got the motivation from this book right here. Ah, oh, the motivation from this book to make a million rent. So that makes you not give up. I'm excited, Luandre. I'm excited. You see, this is a beautiful story. You know, guys, what is the date today? It's the 3rd 20th of January, 2021. So, are we going to check mid year how much have you made? So that when it comes to year end, we also check how much you have made. Luandre, apply this basic principle. You bank every day, but you bank the money that you are not going to use the following day. You put, put fuel here, you go and work hard. I know it's difficult, my boy. Sometimes the, the sign is hitting hard on you. You know, sometimes things are, going very, are not going very well. But guess what? Push. But tell me, do you, have, do you normally have some time to eat when you work? Um... No, I don't. Do you bring your 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 your, your food uh, or you don't? No, I buy some food. Oh, you buy? Oh, how much do you spend on food that you eat? Uh, less than hundred. Yo, that is too much, Luanze. You must just buy one brown bread. Uh, uh, and, and, and a small juice or maybe sometimes water you can't be eating so much no 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 you can't be eating so much just one brown bread juice or water sometimes that will keep you going you will only come and eat good food when you come from work because here we will provide good food but if you are working no you must eat less than uh, 50 rand, like. maybe 40 rand. One brown bread, bread is not expensive. So, please, don't buy takeaways, Luanda. Please. I can buy takeaways. Yeah, you must be a disciplined business person. Are you? A, are, do you regard yourself as a business person? I am a businessman. You are a businessman. Oh my goodness, this is very exciting. You are a businessman. At your age, how old are you? Um, I'll be turning 19 this year. You'll be turning 19. Luanda will be turning 19. He's already a businessman with a transport and logistic business. This is very exciting. Guys, apply the basic principle of how I have made my first million. Be like Luanda. Be encouraged. Take an opportunity. Seize the moment. Never give up. Make sure that you don't spend your money on buying foods and expensive clothes until you make your own first million rand.